Good afternoon, everybody. Well, this is our third segment of the day. It is Friday afternoon here. And in some parts of the world, it could be Friday evening leading into Saturday morning. I'm not sure, but I want to acknowledge that just in case if I have any viewers that are in different parts of the world, I want to identify them and respect them for their time and allowing themselves to take the time to uh, listen to what I have to say, uh, if it's on a daily basis or a weekly basis or even just once a month. I thank you for that. Now, one of the things I wanted to leave everybody off with for the weekend as they take some time to hopefully reflect, relax, and rejuvenate and possibly have a little fun is the idea of progress. And why do I want to talk about progress? Well, I've talked about progress in many of my post uh, videos, as well as the posts that I've actually written and, and uh, sent out uh, to the world. And one of the things that I want to capitalize on leading into the weekend is this. The world is changing. The world is evolving on a consistent basis. It is not standing still. There's always something new coming. There's always something new happening. There's always something... Uh, new that that is in technology that we need to give us the edge to make things go faster, better, quicker. And as human beings, we also have to have the capabilities to be flexible enough to go with the flow of life and with the times. But we don't have to become it. We just have to go with the flow of it and leverage it to help us be better. And how do we be better? How do we get better? Well, one of the ways is to identify something called progress. Progress is important for us because progress gives us meaning in respect to giving us a structure towards our day-to-day -day life. And when we make progress, if it's within our dreams and our goals, um, or if it's within a mental shift or progress in our physical state, in our spiritual state, uh, or even in our financial states, it allows us to have something that's a benchmark to propel us and push us forward uh, to keep on getting better. But the main ingredient towards progress and making progress is identifying your reasons why you want to do it. Because let's face it, not everybody's going to want to make progress because to a certain degree, they don't have a strong enough why. So what is your why or what are your whys towards making progress? Because progress is a day to day thing. It's not something that is a, you know, a one stop shop. And with progress comes the reasons. And with those reasons, they give you purpose and meaning towards your passion. And you need those reasons to keep you alive. Let's look at a situation where a person might be in a negative situation where they want to, uh, don't feel comfortable with their life or they don't love what they're doing or they're contemplating wanting to end their life or whatever the case may be. To a certain extent, they don't have enough reasons why to stay alive. And they are searching for meaning to stay alive. So if we are searching for meaning to stay alive or are searching for meaning to live with purpose and passion, what's your reason for doing that? And when you can identify your reasons, your reasons are going to give you purpose and meaning. And that purpose and meaning leads to progress. So let's make progress. Let's take it one step at a time, one day at a time, one week at a time, one month at a time, and one year at a time. Because that's what life is about, inch by inch. You have to crawl before you can walk. 